Hello everyone, Cheryl Ann here with another completed journal for you today. This is one of my little single signature journals. There's the front, and there's the back. Really love this one with all the pinks and the, and the blues. It says, inspired by nature. favorite place so let's take a look she is 10 by 6 she has 11 sheets of paper for 44 sides and on the inside oh she has this gorgeous this was a leaning tree um, card that I found at our little thrift shop up in the mountains and I cannot find this anywhere else I have one left so this one with the two little girls in the garden and the watering can and their little tools and their little helpers. This one went in here and she has a little extra. She's got a lot of journaling cards. Mm. Isn't that adorable? Oh, and this fabric. Oh my gosh, with the pink flowers. I think I got that at Hobby Lobby, but don't quote me. I'm pretty sure, but it just, it matched, it matched the front so well. I, I just don't think I could ever make another one like this one. So this is one of a kind. I did use some digitals by Calico Collage, and this is her grandma's garden. Now, I did leave some of the pages blank. They are not tea or coffee stained, because I know some people don't like that. So these have not been uh, stained at all. I did use fabric on some of the edges and um, some fabric I use for pockets or decorations. She's just really bright and cheerful. There's a little journaling card. The houses. Here's some garden fabric. Oh, this sunflower watercolor. Oh my gosh, love it. Um, I don't remember who that was from. That's from somebody different. <laughs> the blue went with the blue here. I thought, oh, somebody, you can put her in your purse. You can take her with you. This, this is so cute. I had a friend send me some of her stuff. So Libby, I did use your stuff. Oh, this is Mrs. Cog, Mrs. Cog's Crafts. Look at that. What a gorgeous garden. That's a nice journaling card heavy-duty scrapbook paper <laughs> is a little a little tab oh and here's a bookmark <clears throat> that will go with her those are actually some of my Oliox from a couple years ago love this one with the sunflower and the ladybug another little tab <laughs> another card and pocket another little another little side pocket oh, look at the sunflowers well, I, have, I have a bunch of sunflowers coming up out front just from seed from the bird seed that has fallen on the ground yes as long as I Give them a little bit of water, because you know we're in a drought. A little bit of water, though. They keep going. Oh, this with the butterfly. Oh, isn't that gorgeous? So I put it with the, with the lavender. Oh, that's not a pocket. That's just on there. Really pretty fabric here. On the little nest with the bird. 
Let us be grateful to people who make us happy. They are the charming gardeners who make our souls blossom. Oops, I fell out. There, that's a little corner tuck. And that's the back, and I, there's the back pocket with a couple little journaling cards. And um, I'm gonna include this little envelope and it's it's got some other extra writing cards on it so here's there's the side view like i said should be perfect to take in your in in your purse on your travels um i did go over this with the gel medium and then i went over that with the wax paper so it has a night it's not sticky at all has a nice soft feel. So she will be in my Etsy shop, Deserts and Beyond. So come on over and take a look. Until next time, bye for now.